Hey, what's going on? I just uh, picked up this here box project. Here it is. It's a 99 Outback. The engine's not in it right now, but uh, the, I'm gonna get that from the guy. But it was overheating, so I'm gonna replace the head gaskets on it. And then uh, he said it has a transmission code for pressure control solenoid. So I'm gonna take his word for that and hopefully the, uh, um, can fix the valve body on that, do a video about how that gets done. This is the interior, it's got 181,000 miles. The seat's a little worn, got a divot to it, you know, burn hole. And then, yeah, 180,000 miles worth of wear. And the wire is poking through on the seat, which is normal for older cars. Uh, it's automatic, came with a grill. Never seen one of these cars with a grill before. <clears throat> they always fall off. And looks like we have some stuff in the back. Let's see. There. So reservoir, some brake fluid and coolant. It's full. And alternator. have some red fans must be for racing uh, need to put that cover back on the strut that one's there that's okay air filter box and some miscellaneous stuff and a spare fog light that's another thing is these things always have broken fog lights and these covers for the strut covers. Oh, that's good. Cool. All right. Seats are clean. As long as there's no leaks. Which we're good there. Okay. The factory wheels. The tires are. Not too bad. I mean, they're not the greatest, but they're there. They're decent enough. Front tire. Yeah, it's fine for what you'd expect. So, grills inside the car. Got both the fog lights and it's got a spare. Pretty cool. Not too bad here. You know, a little bit of a rough spot. But that's the car, this tire. Yeah, I mean, they're probably four or five, 30 seconds. And this one's better. I mean, it's, it's must have been replaced. So, uh, brakes, can't really seem that good, but there's no rust on that brake pad and it seems to be uh, a ways away from the rotor. So I'll do a better inspection when I get the wheels off and I get the car all backed up. Oh yeah, the brakes are good, the front ones. Um, let's see that. So that little rusty sliver beneath the backing plate on the painted brake pad is the pad itself. So we're good. It's probably got quite a bit of meat left, like eight or so. And here's the back. No real major damage. 
So hopefully I can do the head gaskets, fix the check engine light with the transmission code, and then drive it for a little bit and see if somebody wants to buy it. Thanks for watching.